King Alfonso sent his most loyal and able servant Rodrigo Diaz the Cid into exile with only his horse Pavieca. Myself and our two daughters were left at the monastery in Castile. When Rodrigo and I parted, it felt like a nail being torn from its finger. Rodrigo rode alone into the Castilian winter. He was not alone for long. Everywhere the Cid went, mercenaries and soldiers were eager to follow. Soon he had a small army of his own. But the Cid was not content to wander the wilds of Castile forever. He needed a castle and a lord to serve. This too he found in the most unlikely of places. I cannot stand this sight of you, El Cid. I command that you leave my kingdom at once. My Cid, here is your horse. Do not judge King Alfonso too harshly. We will open the gates for you now. Godspeed. That's enough of a head start. If the Cid shows his face near our city again, you may open fire. King Alfonso is a fool to send you into exile. We will follow where you lead, my Cid. heard of your situation and welcomes you to join him at his city of Zaragoza. It is just a short ride to the southeast of here. My Cid, King Alfonso has blockaded the gap leading to Zaragoza. If we are to get through, we must siege his castle. Perhaps we can find the troops we need to the south. My Cid, what little we have is yours, if you can just destroy Alfonso's castle to the north. Nam Al Hujum Hassan Nam Hassan
نعم سأفعل الهجوم نعم 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 الهجوم الهجوم سأفعل حسنا 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 الهجوم نعم مستعد القتال هجوم نعم نعم الهجوم نعم نعم حسنا نعم هجوم مستعد سأفعل الهجوم against each other. Let us call a truce and each just go our separate ways.